Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's Mike and Kim here. Hope you have a great day or night. Today's adventures, we're not too sure what we're doing yet, but we know we're going to... My favorite store, Home Depot. Home Depot. Today's, more projects. More projects for Kim. Today's starting off as, as a great day. I flipped this camcorder that I talked about in the previous video that the guy offered me 70 bucks for, and it sold for full price. The dude just freaking clicked buy it now, and the money went right to the PayPal, and you know, we're three hours richer. <laughs> but we're not spending it right away. Yeah, we want to make sure, this is what we do when we sell higher price ticket items, is we always wait it out. We don't touch that money, and we just make sure it sits there, make sure the buyer's happy, and because uh, you never know, right? We live in a crazy time. The guy might not like it, he might want to use it for a week and return it. You never know. So, uh, yeah, other than that, let's see what we do today. Hey, Kim. Can I talk to the coach? No. Coach Dickes? No. No? guy right here wearing a Chicago Bears vintage sports specialties hat. He looks homeless, doesn't he? Yeah, uh, might be. He's playing one hell of a scratch off ticket. Yeah, he's, <laughs> he's winning big or something. Because we just know. went into uh, Circle K here. I haven't had a pop in a while, so uh, enjoying my little split of Mountain Dew and Mountain Dew Code Red. Well, what's on this now? What'd you get? Well, I don't know. Working some bars. I'm going to try some Tiger's Milk. So it's like a Charlie Sheen thing, like Tiger Blood, and now it's Tiger Milk. I have peanut butter in here. Mm. Not too bad. And it's protein rich. I can't do it anymore, guys. I can't do it. <laughs> All right. Tiger's Milk didn't agree with me. So, uh. <laughs> Is it coming back to bite you? Oh, man, I don't know. <laughs> Hoping to get some energy from it. Off to the entrance of the Home Depot. So what are we buying today? We're buying some stain. And we are going to redo our kitchen, our bathroom first. Bathroom, huh? You're going to work the Bombay mahogany? Yeah, I'm just deciding whether to go with gloss or whether to go satin. Well, that's all going to be up to you. It sure is, isn't it? Now if I buy you another one of these brushes, you're going to take care of it? Okay, well the first one was because of my hand. That's why we lost that one. Okay, but this is like the ninth one I've bought in a year. Yeah. Well, so are you, going to are you going to treat this stain brush with care? I'll do my best. Did you know <clears throat> you can cut it yourself here at Home Depot? Cut it yourself with a handsaw. Alright. We're gonna want to cut this here with a. What size, ma'am? I don't know yet, sir. Alright, well, we'll give you a little taste. This is how you get hurt here. There's a freaking screw right here. Does anybody just have a damn saw? That clean cut. So Kim, since you're uh, you're doing some shopping, can we go shopping? Yeah. Half off the Salvation Army. When's the last time you've been thrifting? Uh, it's been a while. You want to go and try some of the madness? I guess we could see. Ten minutes in and out at the Salvo. If you'd like to, we can go. Yes. Let's go thrifting. Well, well, well. We meet again, Salvation Army. It's packed today, Kim. Half off. It is? So, so, I, th I think so. I don't know. Maybe they changed things since we've come here. But it's noon, so let's see if we can find anything okay. at the Salvation Army. Lens. Look at that. I, is that even real? Like <laughs> Slim Pickens in here today. Place has been picked over. But there's got to be something in here for me to find. This is cool. Cracked. For an adult. 
Once again, if you have kids inside the store, they have to remain by your side. There are posters posted all over the store. They have to remain with you, okay? That is for Keep their those kids safety. With you, Kim. Señores y señoras, si traen hijos con ustedes, tienen que mantenerse con el adulto. Kim. <laughs> Well, that was quite disappointing here at Salvation Army. A lot of junkage in there, huh? Yeah, no, that's, that's so great. Picked up one thing, one thing only. Are you driving? No, I'm not driving. I'm trying to. I'm looking at the camera. So, uh, yeah, rather disappointing. Salvation Army half off day. Nothing too crazy. There's a global voodoo hut, and then there's a pizza hut. Did you get your pizza hut fixed, Kim? So yeah, once you get the little cravings for Pizza Hut, you gotta get your little eats on. And uh, we'll see Pizza Hut again, probably another nine months. Cam, I did it again. What'd you do? I sold two of the DVDs from the, the hall. Wow, those are flying off the shelves. Yeah, not as fast as I want them to, but hey, 20 bucks, it's 20 bucks. Woohoo! Hey, hey. All right, so this is our master bathroom that we're doing here. It looks pretty nice. Put yeah, stain I mean, on there. it's just like one coat at the moment. It's You're going to think multiple coats? Better. Yeah, definitely two, and then I'm going to have to go from there and see. It looks nice, though. Now people are going to yell because they're going to say, Kim, you should have taken the cabinets off. It oh, would have yeah. made things easier. Oh, yeah, there's always everybody else out there. But we've got these European screws on here, and for just this little thing, I don't know. I, I think it's fine. I think I can be okay with it. Looks good. Not too shabby. Let's get the sales going. We got some auctions ending a little later today. So uh, hopefully tonight we'll finish up strong. Okay, here's what I picked up at the Salvation Army. Uh, it was half off day, so I spent fifteen thirty-five, And it's just for this JVC camcorder. It is a model number GRDP25U. It appears to be complete. It's got the batteries, got the charger. It's also got the input connection on it. Um, nothing too crazy. This one is pretty basic. There's no night shot or anything like that, but just a good standard uh, DV camera quarter, camera quarter. <laughs> and uh, so uh, at some point here, I'll test it. We'll fire it up, and um, hopefully it works. If it works, it should be 50 and up on this uh, for this camcorder. Now, the great thing about Salvation Army is if it doesn't work, even though it says sold as is, they will allow me to return it within seven days. So uh, it's kind of a win-win, kind of a no-brainer. All right, here are some titles I'm putting together in a box that I'm going to do some declutter with or sell to a pawn shop. Just basically going to get them all filled up in a box here. And uh, once it's filled up and I've got no more DVDs on this table, we'll start to go through that process there. But uh, slowly climbing up to be, uh, in my eyes, a little bit of duds here. Guess what, Kim? What? Two more DVDs from that lot sold. Jesus. <laughs> $37. I'll take her. That's great. You know what I don't understand, Kim? What do you understand? I've had three people message me today, hey, I'm interested in the item, right? This is offer up, Facebook Marketplace, let go. Yeah. And they, oh, I'll be there in two hours. I'll be here in 30 minutes. Well, who does this stuff and then doesn't even communicate? All three of these people throughout the day. Oh yeah, I'm interested. I'm gonna come by. I said, okay, let me know when you're ready, and I'll give you my, you know, I'll give you an address. So you can we can meet up. This is that. So I just did a follow up thing. To all of them say, just are you still interested? Blah blah. blah nothing. It's like window shoppers. It's crazy. But you know, it's like for every five window shoppers, you get a buyer. So 
I guess that's how local cells work, man. It's craziness. But it's still pretty, well, it's about five o'clock right now, so uh, we'll see if, uh, you never know. Maybe people get off work or whatever, they'll come pick it up. You never know with these people. But as long as they give me the moolah, I'll be happy. All right, let's wrap this video up here. Uh, listed 15 movies for $165.69 um, with an average of $11.20 uh, a piece, which isn't bad. That brings the running total to $1,322 gross of what I currently have listed from that DVD haul. So uh, today's been a productive day. Uh, great sales today, especially the one item there that popped pretty good. I'm um, just going to stay busy, keep listing some items, getting these DVDs taken care of. Um, just, I still got a, a boat ton to go through. Plus, I haven't even hit the electronics part of it. I haven't listed those hard drives, the fans, any of that stuff. So, uh, just going to keep my head down and keep moving forward. Hope you're out there listing items, making sales. Go out there and be great. Next time I'm out here, peace. Vlog.